And he's able to go back shoulder that time to Tyler Eifert. There's Dalton the pass again, and a crossing route to Boyd, and he goes past midfield for on 31st against the pass so far this season. Play action, and here they come. And coming in is Devin Bush. Him in a hole. Third and 14. As they set up Mixon, Mixon reverses course and can't get to the outside as good pursuit comes in from Joe Hay. There's Juju in motion for Rudolph, who will have his first pass attempt of the night, and it's a short completion to Johnson. Ball came out, and the Bengals are saying they have it. And they do! Of Cincinnati. Three-step for Dalton, quick to the outside, and this time does connect with Tate, who's ridden out by Hayden. So after the fumble, what do the Bengals come up with? Off the fingers of Eifert. It's okay, it's early. Here's a quick strike on the slant as he goes to Juju Smith. Because they know he's comfortable with them. The RPOs and throwing deep. Second and one play caller's dream. Just moved the chains here with Connor. Front four plays against this Steeler offensive line. Here's Samuels with a tap pass to James Connor, and Connor goes ahead off the jet motion for a first down. The game in rhythm for Mason Rudolph. Here's Johnson now as Johnson catches a seam. Nell Jr. in the game now at running back. As he has met, tried to get that dive ahead. It's your fourth and one. James Conner, not gonna get it. Brandon Wilson came all the way around. Second and 11, four-man rush to the outside, batted away that time by Mike Hilton, giving the look of it, and then he backs off into coverage. Third and 11, pressure on Dalton, floats it, and it should have been picked off by Joe Hayden, but he drops. Third round pick by the Steelers in 2018. Here's Samuels again, who is showing up as a big part of the game plan early on. James Conner now is going to probe that left side. There just wasn't much there that time. Use the hands. Hands in the face. Defense number 99. And nine. And I set up the screen here to James Conner. As Conner, good job of keeping his balance and surging ahead. Good night. Connor is met and goes ahead for about a yard and a half. Jalen Samuels moves over to the slot. They only bring three on third and four, and that had no chance. Here's Dalton inside his own five. And as he tried to go underneath, but well, that was the first round pick of the Falcons. Third down and ten. Dalton pumps once and then tries to drive the ball to John Ross. See if Huber can play keep away. Instead, he skies this, and it forces the fair catch. Play action. Rudolph, as he will go underneath to Connor. That gives us a chance to check in with which quickly, didn't it? Second and two. Here's a sprint right and an easy catch for Samuels. In just by running backs, just to showcase that point. Here's second and seven. As he goes to another running back, Samuels for reserve. So they're down two tight ends, and they make the trade for Nick. Third and two. Rudolph. How about it? James Conner. Touchdown, Steelers. So far for Mason Rudolph. Now here's Joe Mixon as Mixon hits that hole quickly and surges ahead for 10 yards. Dalton quarterback sneak and he's able to go through for a yard and a half and a up. quick strike what a catch second and five Dalton with a lot of time and on the crossing route he gets it to Tyler Boyd who grew up 15 minutes away from him. second and eight to the outside and complete again to Ross for a first down. Pressure off the edge. And the ball's out. And 
the Steelers recover. It was Bud Dupree who chopped down. Absolutely. He's got it all. He's so young. Second and seven. And once again, going to the running back. And once again, moving the chains. Eight more years. One man rush against Rudolph and underneath to Johnson. Remember, Johnson fumbled early at running back. Rudolph looking over his options, checks down to Samuels, who beats the first man easily and then takes a wiggle past midfield. Again. <laughs> and Connor right through the middle. Samuels right through the middle. Get it out to Juju in space as he turns the corner and as Kirkpatrick tried to make that. Second and two, James Conner with Washington in front and look at the room he has there. Bengals. Here's Rudolph as he goes inside the 10 and Deontay Johnson is able to hook his tap. Third and two, Samuels. Great job by Nick Vigil. And Boswell maintains that perfect stretch. And here is Andy Dalton. Remember, no timeouts remain for the Bengals as he connects with Alton. Everyone knows the protection. Dalton had to do everything he could just to hold on to that football that time. On to 16, 15. As he's just going to check down to Giovanni Bernard. And Bernard is up and now. Back to Mason Rudolph. And this offense is James Conner with a good chunk play to open up the second five. They bring pressure. Rudolph. Gets it complete for a first down as Samuels has become a good 11 passes prior to that. Now it's second and 15. Rudolph. As he throws short and is able to find Van Ness. He's lined up with the direct snap. And he taps it to Connor who's back in. That's a good sign for the Steelers and this is better. As he spins his way inside the five and what an effort from James Conner. As Conner's playing that motion H-back position, Samuels, all too easy. Drive. Dalton gets the ball out quickly, but it's off the hand. Dalton. A little bit of traffic, and then he goes down. Ohio State just gets pushed back into Andy Dalton. Third and 21, and that is incomplete as Auden Tate couldn't hold on. This is not a good looking punt at all. And hundredth all time meeting between Steelers and Bengals. The advantage because the defense doesn't count the quarterback as a runner. Downfield strike, wide open, Johnson. It's about the draft pick. Joe Mixon gets free as he's out to the 40-yard, second and five. We go with the pitch here to Mixon as he leaps and makes his way past the line to make and crosses midfield. That's they really respond to what Pittsburgh has been able to do. Dalton, pressure, and raining down on him is T.J. Watt. Dalton. And as that's incomplete, as he was hoping for anything. Well, maybe you get the first down that way. And they take him down again. Right. It's Connor. Follows the block well. De Castro is out in front. Rudolph on third and three. And as he drives it to the outside, but nobody was there. Yards. Second and six. Mixon jump cut to the outside, but then waiting on him was Mark Barron and Devin Bush. 
Dalton drives it over the middle and in cutting rope, and it's complete. Dalton, this time able to get it to team up short at Buffalo 21 to 17. Dalton's gonna read it, keep it himself, and dive ahead. And Elliott down and one. As mixing good leg drive that time to earn the first down. Ninth play here of this drive. It's a third and ten. Incomplete. And the flag comes in. It's interference. Defense number 22. Second and 11. Dalton. On that in cut this time goes back to Tate. And that big body bounces. Here's Bernard. And that falls after he deflected it. Second 10. That was a good catch that time by John Ross, who's able to spin and wrestle his way for a first down. Back home here in Pittsburgh. Dalton lost it to the end zone, and it's incomplete. And as he was looking for Tyler. Intercepted. And that ends that. Overstated the first three weeks. We go with Johnson again, and what a nice cut by Johnson after the... Personal foul. Defense number 23. Like the energy that Zach Taylor's brought from the West Coast to the East Coast. Here's a third and nine for Mason Rudolph as he gets it to Samuels, who cuts to the outside, then dives ahead. For then they're doing things differently. Meaning, they're not going to try to just run up the middle. They're doing stuff on the edges. Right. The tap passes, the jet sweep. They're trying to get the football. Well, this is what we've seen. Oh. Defense number 99. 15-yard penalty. Exceptions on the night. Pittsburgh runners. Here's second and eight. And add another one, and that's how James Conner couldn't get free of Nick Mitchell. And they're going to bring this thing in for an easy landing here at home. <laughs> Dalton. Incomplete. thing that they wanted to do this year, they being ownership and Zach Taylor, the head coach. That's going to be short of the first down. And as Bernard is able to muscle his way. That ball is battered away by Mike Hilton, mm -hmm. creating a culture to always raise the standard. That's what Sean McVay delivered. And this is what Cameron Hayward can deliver when he comes. Looking just to set up the screen here as he does so. With but they still have to make these teams better. Here's fourth down and nine. And Dalton's going to go downfield, and that's well overthrown, so it'll be a turnover on downs. A flag is down. That's the interference. That's interference. Defense number 23. Go. Nothing getting going there. Dalton on third and ten, as that's incomplete. Downs try to establish the running game. They did that on the edges. So all in all, it was a good night tonight. Fourth down, he goes down again. Tyson Alou Alou. To bolster the defense, so the offense wouldn't have to score a ton of points. And then, now you get the AFC North here, right? So you get this one, and now you got the Ravens coming up, and things got really muddled up with all the two and two teams throughout the league. So as we said, only a game behind. You go from 0 and three, and you're struggling and hoping to saying hey we're right back in this thing now it's early they got to feel pretty good just a game behind